Good afternoon, Internet. Requisite kitty. I'm back. Um, I thought I would try something slightly different today. I am going to go ahead and play through a small amount of Trine 2 while we're doing this. Um, consider this a test of some variety, see if people like this. Uh, don't expect anything significant. I'm actually going to be more talking than playing in this case. Um, so, Trine 2 is the sequel to one of my favorite recent games. Um, that being Trine 1. Surprise, surprise. I know, it's horribly shocking. Um, so, Trine 2 is a action-adventure platforming puzzle game. Don't kill me. No, um, I'm a big fan of Trine 1. I've played through it a bunch. Outside of the final level, it is a perfectly cromulent game. Um, Trine is a spiritual successor to the Lost Viking series. The Lost Viking series originally created by Silicon and Synapse, which some of you may know by their new name, Blizzard Entertainment. Yeah, um, The Lost Vikings was a game that had three Vikings. They went around, solved puzzles, platforming. Pretty simple game. I grew up with it. So, the reason why I wanted to do these is that, or this particular Vita, is that I wanted to see how this looked, if people like this, um, opinion about things, stuff like that. Because what I am planning on doing after Vita is up is that I'm going to continue vlogging. I'm going to continue vlogging um, probably only weekly in May due to me moving, people being over for one weekend, house, 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 and house. But past that, I'm thinking about doing this maybe a few times a week. And one of those times would end up being a Let's Play type of vlog, where I end up talking and playing a game at the same time. When it comes to these, I'm thinking one of three things. Either one, I'm going to go ahead and uh, play through a game that I've never played before. I have, or played very little of before. I'm still in the beginning parts of trying to, so that would probably be one of those. Um, so, uh, that's one of the ideas. So, games on my backlog right now, trying to include it. Uh, the second thing would be games that are old and classic, or at least my definition of classic. Uh, a lot of people haven't played a lot of the older PC games, and that's a shame. There's a lot of... I wouldn't call them beautiful games, and Trine 2 is far more beautiful than any game that I'd be showing you, most likely. In fact, I would go so far as to say Trine 2 is one of the most beautiful games I own. No, I'm talking about good games, fun games, games that I just grew up with as a child and have a ridiculously nasty nostalgia filter on. Uh, the final option would be games that I can utterly curb stomp without much thought. Uh, games like Sid Meier's Alpha Centauri, um, Shining Force 2, Final Fantasy Tactics, games like that, where I don't necessarily need to pay attention in order to curb stomp, and it would be kind of amusing in the background. Uh, those games would probably be better for things where I'm primarily talking about something and then just happen to be playing a game in the background. Let me know what you think. Um, go ahead and post in the comments. Um, post on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, IRC. I'm everywhere. So, um, this is also a test to see how well, how much I can handle background audio and stuff like that. I have no idea if this is too loud right now. This is actually take five of this. Five. All of the others have been ridiculously loud. The heroes had found themselves in a magical forest. Pontius had been quite taken by the ladylike flower they had encountered. Amadeus thought the matter with the flower was some kind of an enchanted practical joke. Zoya didn't think this or that about the flower. We'll wait and see, she pondered. So the three characters of Trine 2 are, or four characters really. There is Pontius, who is the um, knight character. Uh, Amadeus is the wizard character. And Zoya is the thief, I mean, um, adventurer, treasure hunter, what have you. Um, Zoya is my favorite character, and it's also the one that I'm best at playing using. You actually switch between all three of the characters throughout the levels and so on. Um, what else can I say? Not really much. I'm going to try to keep this relatively short, at least for me. Oh, wow, I'm currently deadish. Whoops. There you go, heal up. Oh, 
So, um, this is trying to. I'm not really doing a whole bunch. This is not really meant to be a let's play. I'm not exactly going to go on very far. Yay, patterns. Yay, my platforming skills. They don't suck that bad. I totally screwed that up. I think my summon box is the biggest one, so I'm going to go ahead and use that one as the base. Build myself a staircase. Not really to heaven. I would probably call that more hell-like. I'm not talking a whole bunch right now, I apologize. I'm still kind of getting used to this idea. How am I getting out of that? There we go. So, enjoy internet. 